The science behind No Nut November. Every year, men from across the globe test their resilience by abstaining from masturbation for 30 long, excruciating days in an act known as No Nut November. Emerging from the shadows of the Internet's strangest corners, the annual Internet Challenge has become a globally recognized phenomenon, with those undertaking the act citing major sexual health and psychological benefits. The medical industry, however, isn't quite so convinced about the practice of semen retention. For many, No Nut November has been associated with a string of potential health benefits, ranging from improved sexual stamina through to enhanced cognitive function and mood stabilization. While the stories could well be true, Lawrence Levine, MD, board-certified urologist, explains that there is little evidence to support the mental and physical health claims of male sexual abstinence. While the physiological benefits of short-term abstinence are minimal, some men do report psychological benefits, such as increased self-discipline or a heightened sense of focus. It's a highly individual experience with limited clinical data one way or the other. In recent years, Australian research studies have suggested a strong correlation between ejaculation and fertility, with Dr. David Handelsman of the University of Sydney revealing that reduced sexual function was strongly associated with a reduction in serum testosterone. The studies oppose the commonly held theory amongst No Nut November participants that semen retention will lead to enhanced physical health. However, the impact on testosterone production is harder to determine. Dr. Levine revealed that abstinence in the initial stages may lead to increased testosterone production. However, it is unlikely to last. However, some studies suggest that regular ejaculation might be associated with a reduced risk of prostate cancer, though the correlation isn't definitively established. Follow AID for more fascinating news and updates. Thanks.